Genesis is written by Moses. Correct? Moses is the one who wrote this letter. Was it Moses after Abraham or before Abraham? After. So whatever he saw, he wrote it. Okay? In Genesis chapter 30, you don't need to turn back. He says about Bethel. There is a place where Abraham goes and talks about Bethel. But when Abraham went, that place was called not Bethel. It was less less. Jacob was the one who goes and named the place as Bethel. You're getting me? So Moses knows it. So when he wrote it, he wrote it on that reference. Okay? In the same way, in Genesis chapter 12, verse 1, Yahweh is being written. L O R D in capital. Because Moses had that one in Exodus chapter 14. So he got the revelation and he wrote it. Meaning, the same Yahweh who spoke to me on the mountain is the same Yahweh who spoke to me to Abraham. That is a reference or, or uh, here Moses is bringing it up. You have that perspective. If you read it bluntly, it will be different. But when you have how Moses wrote it, he is making sure, brother, when you read it, who spoke to Abraham, it is the same God who spoke to me, it is the same God who spoke to Abraham. That's the difference making it up. If you read it very clearly, L-O-D is being capitalized. 